What's up everybody, Thunderbolt here, and welcome back to Farming Simulator 2015. This is episode 9, and today we are going to start getting some uh, stuff going for harvesting that grass field that we planted last game. If we uh, click around a little bit uh, to this guy, you'll see he's got a little bit of the field left. Um, somehow he got stuck. I don't, I don't know what's going on with that, but... Um, So he's going to finish seeding this field of grass and wait for that to grow. But basically we're here at the, the shop because we got some stuff we need to buy. So we got about 82,000 82, um, euro and we're going to buy some stuff. So we need a wind rower. So we're going to buy this guy. And we need this loading wagon. So we're going to buy this one. Trying to think if there's anything else I have to buy right now. Oh yeah, we need a mower also. So I was gonna buy, I was gonna buy this guy. All right, uh, my dogs are barking. Be right back, guys. All right, we're back. All right, so we're going to um, got our new tools here. So we got our wind rower. We got the. Um, which is made by Kuhn. We got the Euroboss. Um, uh, what are these called? Called loading wagons. And we got a Kuhn mower. Let's go ahead and get some of this stuff home. Um, crap, I have the weight on the front of it. Um, I know what I can do. Want to get two of the two of these things home at the same time, so to do that, I'm gonna have to do this a little differently. Because I don't want I don't want to just um, you know reset it and send it home that way. So we got the mower. Um, it's pretty cool. Lower it. <clears throat> Turn it on, all that good stuff. It's like a rower. Mower would work. And then with this, I should be able to... Darn, I thought this would work. Yay, apparently. Oh, because it needs an electrical connection. That's fine. I think we can, yep, we can connect this though. All right, let's get back to the farm. The car's coming. stuff parked over by um, by the grass field because where we're we gonna be using it I don't think there is a storage barn over there anywhere so that might be a problem I guess we'll find out in a minute though check on the other guy who is um, seeding the field right now. Oh, I forgot we still got the fertilizer sitting out too. Have to get that put back into the, the barn soon. Barn. It's like cramping. Too much computer games today so far. <laughs> Been playing WoW all morning. It's finally able to get on the server some of this morning play play around for a little while. Look, uh, level up my guy a little. I 
Oh, actually, there is a storage barn. There's one right here. I forgot there's one here at the grain mill, so we can always use this one. There's that one right there. I think that's the closest one to the field. So that's the one we'll probably have to use. the cedar. Alright, there he is. He's down there. It's a little barn over here. But this is like a different farm, actually, so... I wish this door would open. So, I don't think that's really... So that doesn't really look like anything we can use. So let's get this pulled off to the side over here. I'm gonna get the wagon. I'm gonna leave the wagon right here. set up right here. Alright, now we gotta go grab the forge. The, um, gotta go grab the wind rower. So I'm gonna go grab that real quick. And uh, gonna cut the video and we'll be back once um, back at the field. Alright guys, we're back. And the tractor has finished sowing the field. So that's good. We're now, uh, this field is all ready. We just need it to grow now. So I'm going to go ahead. I think that means all of our fields are planted now. Um, yep, they're all planted and growing. So that means we just got to wait for all of the crops to grow now. So I'm going to get this tractor put back at the farm. Now I'm going to make sure the cedar gets put back into the, um, you know, into the, um, into the storage shed. And then I'm going to go and I'm going to show off the time acceleration mod that I have installed. I'm going to really speed up time until the crops have grown. And then we're going to go ahead and harvest. So that would be cool. Um, let me make sure I get the fertilizer put away as well. So I think the weather forecast, yeah, it's not supposed to rain until Sunday. So that's still like five days out. So we should be good. And still have to get those sticks cleaned up at some point. So I did sell the plow. Um, I'm just, I'm never going to use it for anything because I'm not planning on merging fields together or anything like that. Um, let me get this put back. Because we're going to need to drive this tractor. Oh, no, wait, we have the other tractor at the other farm, so. I said we're going to need to drive this one back over, but I forgot I have the other one over there. Oops. Just ran into my fertilizer. Don't need to fertilize the grass. It'll just grow on its own. Let's get this put back. <clears throat> get this guy back in right here. And let's we'll get this track apart. Sweet. We're gonna get our other tractor part. I'd like to replace this tractor at some point with one that's a little better. Um, Alright, so we're here now. As you can see, we're right here at the edge of the field. 
And in the top left, you will see it says left control and R is to fast forward time. So what you have to do is you have to hold down left control and then you hit, you push down and hold R. And look at that, how fast it speeds time up. It goes 12,000 times. Um, so now all of a sudden it is 12.02 a.m. <laughs> so we're going to continue this. Grass is starting to grow now. See, it's a little bit longer. Check the progress of our other crops. See, they are starting to be darker, darker blue as well. They will grow faster than the grass will. Great demand at transport company for canola. Um, well, that really sucks. Just sold all of our can <coughs> all of our canola. Um, so the <coughs> oh, sorry, excuse me. The other fields are almost ready to be harvested. I think one of those fields is canola, so that'll be good. Um, uh, see, transport. Oh, look at that times 1.5. Oh, man. Oh, dude, that sucks. It's a great demand for canola. Man, that, that's, uh, that kind of sucks. <laughs> um, I really wish we had the canola that I just got done selling. Jeez, I want into this guy. Okay, we're gonna get our harvester back out of here. Get the combine ready for the harvest. Oh, crap. The implements on the other side. Come on. Yep, and there, <laughs> there, there goes the, there goes the header. For some reason, when you, oh god, when you save the game, um, the stuff doesn't stay, like locked onto it like it did when you were um, playing the last time. So just because I saved the game and quit and came back, now the header wasn't on the trailer anymore. Stuff still moves around, basically. That right there. I'm gonna pick the header up. Oops, I didn't mean to get out. I think it's. No, I thought it was tipped around the wrong way. Alright, so let's get this out here. See, I think this is the canola field. Yeah, the other one's the barley field. So this one is the one that's gonna be ready to go first. We're gonna want to get this one harvested and sold like quickly. Um, so let's go control and R. Boom, it's ready. But the it's a great demand. Crap, the great demand's over. Darn it. I that's what I thought. I wasn't gonna have enough time. Alright, so all the fields are ready to harvest. Uh, let's just get this guy going right away. Fold. Oh well. You know, that's fine. We're gonna make sure the lights get turned on here. Um, that's guy is gonna be the one for the trailer. This doesn't look like it's ready to be harvested yet. I'm gonna wait a little bit on that. Um, I'm gonna make sure our cultivator gets hooked back up in a second. <coughs> this guy, I'm <clears throat> gonna need to go grab the trailer. Which is actually down here. I think we're getting near the end of this video, actually. Um, let me check that real quick. Actually got a couple minutes. 
Jesus. trailer out here so I mean this says it's ready to be cut down here you see it's green but um it's not quite oh okay so it'll get like a darker green like the rest of this once it's actually fully ready so we could cut it now but we're not gonna get as much out of it I don't think so um, so I should probably wait. Like, I should probably be waiting on the other fields to cut them, too. But, um, I'm just gonna go ahead and start now. Make sure this guy's in position. He's, uh, he's ready to go as well. Combine, he's at 30%. Let's just get this guy hooked up and ready to go. Oh, yeah, I can't have the weight. So now what I could do is I could probably, probably have the front mower going and then pick it up right away with the trailer. Um, but I don't really want to do that. This is not attaching. There it goes. Um, I kind of just want to, I want to use this and then, so I probably didn't even need to buy the wind rower. But what I'm going to do is I'm just going to mow the whole field and then we're going to use the wind rower to make nice, neat <coughs> um, lines. And then we'll use the wagon to pick it up. So we're not going to worry about it yet. Starts right about here. All right, so we're gonna wait till this has grown a little more. All right, there we go. I think that's fully grown now. Yep, that is. And it's totally, completely dark now, of course, though. Um, so what we're gonna do is we're actually gonna pause this episode here. And we're going to pick it up in episode 10. So thank you guys for watching this episode of Farming Simulator 2015. This is Thunderbolt signing off, and I'll see you guys in the next episode.